The Wizard of Oz is a classic American film, produced in 1939 and directed by Victor Fleming. The movie is based on the novel of the same name by author L. Frank Baum and has become an icon of children's and family literature and cinema. The Wizard of Oz won the Oscar for Best Original Score, the Satellite Award for Best Classic DVD, and is a beloved film that marked the evolution of color cinema, transitioning from black and white to vibrant colors. It remains an indispensable part of the world of cinema and has become an integral part of American literature and culture. What about the current cast of the film? Watch this video to learn more. Judy Garland, born Frances Ethel Gum on June 10, 1922, in Grand Rapids, Minnesota, and passed away on June 22, 1969, at the age of 47. In the film, Judy Garland portrayed the character named Dorothy Gale, who is strong, brave, and has a kind heart. In addition to this famous role, Judy Garland had a diverse acting career in many other films and television shows. She received numerous prestigious awards, including the Oscar for Best Actress for her role in A Star Is Born, 1954. The Wizard Frank Morgan, born Frank Philip Wupperman on June 1, 1890, in New York City, New York, and passed away on September 18, 1949, at the age of 59. In the film, Frank portrayed the antagonistic character, the Wizard of Oz. He played a powerful and mysterious wizard who controlled the Emerald City and helped Dorothy and her companions find their way back home. The Wizard of Oz is a complex and iconic character. Furthermore, Frank Morgan had a diverse acting career with roles in The Shop Around the Corner, The Mortal Storm, and The Three Musketeers. Ray Bolger, born Raymond Wallace Bolko on January 10, 1904, in Dorchester, Massachusetts, and passed away on January 15, 1987, at the age of 83. In the film, Ray portrayed the Scarecrow, a character who is artificial and lacking a brain. Scarecrow is one of Dorothy's three companions on the journey to the Emerald City. With a creative and humorous personality, Scarecrow often asks perplexing questions and helps Dorothy and her friends achieve their goals. Ray was honored with a Tony Award for Best Actor in a Broadway play for his role as the Scarecrow in the stage version of The Wizard of Oz. Jack Haley, born John Joseph Haley Jr. on August 10, 1897, in Boston, Massachusetts, and passed away on June 6, 1979, at the age of 81. In the film, Jack portrayed the Tin Man, a character lacking in compassion and emotions. The Tin Man joined Dorothy and her companions on their journey to the Emerald City to find a solution to his problem. With a personality completely different from the Scarecrow and the Lion, the Tin Man represents another aspect of humanity. Jack Haley was truly a talented actor who left a mark on the history of cinema. Burt Lahr, born Irving Larheim on August 13, 1895, in New York City, New York, and passed away on December 4, 1967, at the age of 72. In the film, Bert Lahr played the cowardly lion, a character who eagerly seeks opportunities to prove himself and find courage. The lion joined Dorothy and her friends on their journey to the Emerald City to learn how to become brave. With a humorous and friendly personality, the cowardly lion is one of the most beloved characters in the film. 
Burt Lahr was honored with a Tony Award for Best Actor in a Broadway play for his animal role in Foxy, 1964. Billy Burke, born Mary William Ethelbert Appleton Burke on August 7, 1884, in Washington, D.C., and passed away on May 14, 1970, at the age of 85. In the film, Billy Burke portrayed Glinda the Good Witch, a character that Dorothy encounters on her way to the Emerald City. Glinda is a gentle and kind-hearted witch who helps Dorothy on her journey and provides valuable advice. Billy Burke participated in various projects and was known for her natural acting ability, leaving a mark in the history of cinema. The Wicked Witch of the West Margaret Hamilton, born on December 9, 1902, in Cleveland, Ohio, and passed away on May 16, 1985, at the age of 82. In the film, Margaret played the role of the Wicked Witch of the West, a famous and malevolent witch pursuing Dorothy and her companions in their journey to retrieve the ruby slippers. With her intimidating appearance and villainous acting, Margaret Hamilton created one of the most terrifying antagonistic characters in the history of cinema. In addition to her acting career, Margaret was also recognized for her work as an advocate for causes designed to benefit children and animals, while remaining committed to public education. Charlie Grapewin was born on December 20, 1869, in Xenia, Ohio, and passed away on February 2, 1956, at the age of 86. In the film, Charlie Grapewin played the role of Uncle Henry, who takes care of Dorothy and Toto on their family farm in Kansas. His character is a friendly man who loves and cares for his family. Apart from his role in The Wizard of Oz, Charlie Grapewin had a diverse acting career in many films and on stage. He was known for his natural acting and played humorous and endearing roles. Clara Blandick was born on June 4, 1876, in Hong Kong and passed away on April 15, 1962, at the age of 85. In the film, Clara Blandick played the role of Auntie M, who takes care of Dorothy and Toto on their family farm in Kansas. Her character is a gentle and loving woman who cares for Dorothy, and along with Uncle Henry, she shows special love and concern for her. Although she later appeared in many other film projects, her role in The Wizard of Oz remained the most prominent in her career. Pat Walsh, whose real name was Patrick Walsh, was born on July 26, 1900, in Kilkee, County Clare, Ireland, and passed away on December 11, 1991, at the age of 91. In the film, Pat Walsh played the role of Nico, the captain of the Wicked Witch's army of flying monkeys. His character is one of the famous creatures in Dorothy's adventure, accompanying the Wicked Witch. Nico was created through makeup and costume to portray a fearsome-looking monkey. In addition to this role, Pat Walsh had some other roles in different films, but the role of Nico was the most prominent and well-known in his career. Thank you for watching the video. If you enjoyed it, please like and subscribe to our channel to stay updated on our latest videos. Goodbye.